Dan, what are you drinking? Mountain Dew Baja Blast. Ugh. What the f I just opened that. That's crap. I can make you something better to drink. Let's go inside. Let's do it. Hey everybody, it's Molly and Dan. Hey everybody. All right. Here. What are we doing today? Uh, today we are making a lime ricky recipe. What's a lime ricky? A lime ricky, I think it's traditionally served as a cocktail. Basically it's lime juice, uh, orange bitters, carbonated water, and I think typically they put gin in it, but this is a virgin lime ricky that we're doing today because I know you don't like alcohol. Oh, that's so nice. you can add whatever alcohol to this that you want to if you want to do that, or you can just leave it as is. So the first thing we need to do is we need to make a simple syrup. So let's go over to the stove. All right, so just combine the sugar and water. So it's just one cup of each. And then you dissolve the sugar, bring it to a boil, boil it for seven minutes and then take it off the heat and let it cool completely. All right, so let's bring those to a boil and then we'll see you guys when this is cool. Okay, so we're impatient and this is mostly cool but still a little warm. So what we're gonna do next is take a pitcher. We're gonna mix our simple syrup and I'm too lazy to squeeze a bunch of limes. So I'm using balls of lime juice. Add our lime juice, and it just says orange bitters to taste. So I don't know how much to do, like a couple dashes, so up to you. And then it said to tint it a delicate green if desired. So I have some Americolor gel uh, food coloring, and it's in the color leaf green. And I'm just gonna take this stuff is pretty potent, so a little goes a long way. So I'm just going to take a toothpick and tint it green. You guys will be able to see it in a minute. And then of course, that's completely optional. You don't have to do that. Now, the recipe will be available for you down below in the description box. So you will have that. Can you toss that for me? Thanks. I have a glass with some ice in it and I have some club soda. So it says a quart of carbonated water, but it tells you to mix this, pour the syrup or the juice part itself into a glass and then top it off with some carbonated water. Oh, can you, can you grab a towel? All right, and don't do what I just did. Stir it up really well. So you can make this as strong as you like. Okay. You ready to taste this again? Yeah. Ooh. That's really refreshing. Jeez. It's not as sweet as I thought it would be. It's a lot more citrusy than I thought it would be. Yeah. Too. So this is really like summer. Summer in a glass. Like, yeah. That's what I was gonna say. So Obviously, you know, you could add more concentrate if you want to. It's not as sweet as I was expecting. I always expect it to be sweeter than it actually is. But this is really refreshing. It tastes like limes with a hint of orange. And it's very fizzy, very bubbly. It's not as sweet as I had expected. So if you want it sweeter, add more simple syrup. If you want it less sweet, take away some simple syrup. So it's really customizable. It says to serve this garnished with a thin slice of orange. Garnish ours with some limes, and I would say that's a delicate shade of green. Yeah, <clears throat> this is delicious. Yeah, it's really good. It tastes like summer in a glass. I would drink it. It's pretty good. Oh, there you go. Oh, thanks, bro. Very refreshing. I've had lime rickies before at bars before, and I think they put gin in them. Mm. If I remember correctly, it was either gin or vodka, one or the other. So. I think that either gin or vodka would be really good in this if you wanted a strong cocktail. So add it however much you want. I think this, I mean, it just tastes good. It's like, a good base. It's a good base. This would make a really good cocktail. But as a virgin cocktail, this is delicious. So kid friendly, damn friendly. If you like this recipe and you want to see more vintage recipes like this, 
Lime Ricky, then please subscribe and hit the like button. I upload new content every Wednesday, sometimes on Friday, and Dan and I are always here taste testing veggie recipes. And I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. So I completely forgot to tell you what book this was from. This Lime Ricky recipe comes from the Woman's Home Companion cookbook, and this is from 1944. So you like how I need to redo my nail polish? Anyways, so that's where this book is from. A nice little 40s recipe. Very delicious. There we go. All right. Have a good day.